16 inmates at the Dane County Jail have COVID-19 today. That's a lot more than how many they've had over the past few weeks. News 3 Now's Naomi Coles explains that spike. The Dane County Jail had reached one of its lowest ever COVID case counts at the end of last week. Just one case. But now new inmates testing positive resulted in that spike this week. And now a housing unit of 116 is in quarantine. Any inmate entering the jail goes through a 14 day quarantine in that housing unit where they get regular testing and symptom monitoring. And if anyone comes down with COVID-19 while there, everyone has to restart quarantine. Our biggest challenge right now are the new people coming into the into the jail. And that's why that 116 person housing unit is such a challenge. Um, because those are all new cases. The sheriff says the old county building where many of them are housed is difficult to keep safe even with their regular cleaning. The sheriff says they are about to introduce new rapid COVID testing for the inmates. He's hoping that's going to help lower case counts and improve safety at the facility. Reporting in Madison, Naomi Coles for News 3 Now. And there have been 115 total positive cases among inmates at the jail this year. That does not include staff.